Hello everyone! Welcome back to Let's Play Earthbound! This is VitaFuser in our last episode! We made it back to Delam and went through the Pink Cloud Shrine facing Thunder and Storm to get our sixth melody and it's time for us to get back to the story. It's time for us to go to Scaraba. All on another continent. I think it's called Chelmy or something? I don't know. We've done all we can in Eagle Land and Foggy Land. Now it's time to go to Chelmy. photograph guy. Now you do actually get unique dialogue if you sail the Scaraba before you go back to DeLong. Thank you! You made me wife wake up. She quit talking about all the serious crap. Yeah, let's work hard. If you're courageous, get on the boat. You'll probably see the Kraken and experience getting seasick. Arr, 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 arr. After all, it can only cost you your life, and you got that for free. Luck will determine the outcome of this voyage. So you want to sail the sea to Scaraba? Twenty bucks per person is fine with me. Ready, we're reckless, baby. Bon voyage! Alrighty, here we go. It's basically a nautical version of the bus theme. Man, it seems like so long ago we started this Let's Play and we are already six melodies through and on our way to our third continent. the boat. It's been a long time since I was out on the open sea, so I feel seasick. Oh man, what am I going to do? A sailor who gets seasick? So how come you guys are alright? So, that bald guy over there. Your buddy, right? He came from Delam. You guys must be quite the adventurers. Ha ha ha, I'm feeling much better now. Now if you hadn't used the carrot key, he would say, my, that carrot key looks quite strange. Have you ever missed home and gone back? Or something to that effect? Anchors away! Block the way. This guy is actually fairly tough. However, I came prepared. too much. Or I could make him look like a chump. 
That's a very healthy experience. I only am, really. Oh man! I thought you guys were just everyday little kids. You defeated the Kraken. I also helped in the battle. I threw my slippers at the beast. Maybe you didn't notice. Did you come all the way from Toto by ship? There's a scary monster in the sea. Did you beat him? Or did you escape? Either way, you are fantastic. Welcome to Scaraba. Boy, have we got lots of things to do here. See, there's the hotel down there. I don't know what's up here. Oh, this is hospital. I'm doing this as a hobby. Isn't it cool? I recently made a friend. He used to be a dungeon maker. And now he's a dungeon man. Would you like to meet him? Alrighty then, I'll give you the key to so that you can enter it. Oh no, I don't have it. I must have lost it somewhere. I'm sorry, I don't worry about small things. Oh, be careful where you walk, it's filthy. A chubby kid did his business out here somewhere. Jeez. He's already been here. Hassan's shop. Dollars acceptable. Welcome, welcome! Ah, the heat. Is your body okay? Can I interest you in some of my merchandise? What would you like? Wet towel, vial of serum, secret, blah, 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 blah. We're gonna want a few wet, wet towels. Gracious and kind. If there's anything else I can do for you, please do not hesitate to ask. May you never find rocks in your sandals. Ugh, that is a horrible feeling. Having rocks in your shoes. Poisonous snakes cost more. Why would a fine young man like you need one? Hello, would you like some seasonings to add to your fools at mealtime? They are really quite miraculous. Whenever you eat something, the seasonings will sprinkle automatically. They come in these cute little packets and jars. What kind do you like? If you use these on the on items, they will enhance it. If you use it with a rock candy, it'll actually add to a certain uh, a random stat. If you have it in the last part, if you have it in the last inventory space of someone's inventory, it'll just use the uh, condiment instead of the rock candy. Using that glitch, you can infinitely use the rock candy. Come again. If you've already got what you need, great. But if you don't, well, that would be a real shame. Take a good look at my menu and decide. Is there anything listed that you might want? Big League Bat, Platinum Band, Crystal Charm, Piggy Nose. This is good to be good for later. Broken Cannon. What does a Broken Cannon do? I think the Broken Cannon is one of uh, Jeff's fixable things. 
So that's a spectrum beam. What have I got for Jeff? A double beam. Yeah, that double beam is already pulling its weight. Hello there, welcome to my humble shop. How about some of our famous scarab delicacies? We carry a variety of things, what would you like? Bean croquettes, molokaya soup, kebab, boiled egg, blah 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 blah. The sun is merciless today, so please take care of yourself. The snake bag can hold live snakes. There are snakes in the sack. You're afraid of snakes, are you not? <laughs> no, it's just not that useful of an item. You have the mark of bad luck on your face. No, don't worry. If you want to know, I'll humbly tell you. You shall come back here. After you have encountered a dangerous situation. However, I may be wrong. If so, a thousand pardons. I've never seen you around here before. What do you want? I do not have anything you would want. The Tenda tribe used to live here. They went to the back of the deep darkness as they were too innocent. I wonder if they are still alive. Tenda tribe, huh? Interesting. Definitely want to save here. but Scaraba is based mostly off of Egypt, modern-day Egypt. As soon as we set foot down there, we are in the equivalent of the Sahara Desert. Yeah. It is very easy to get sunstroke down there. We have much more power points than we have back in Dusty Dunes, but still, be careful. There's also a uh, Master Criminal Caterpillar down here if we are rare enough to get it. I wouldn't expect us to, though. If you're going to the Pyramid, prepare well and be ready for whatever may occur. As you can tell, I've already got. Oh, there's another Buka. All the enemies here are stronger versions of what we've already faced in the desert. Oh, someone's already got Sunstroke. I 
I sell water to those who are thirsty. It's expensive though. Yeesh. Well, you'll die by dehydration. I'm warning you. Yeah, if that was actually a thing in this, I'd be not that happy. But we're already here. Are you a thief, a warrior, or one who has come to see my majesty? You must decide what you really are. Therefore, what will you do? Well, there's only one thing to do, actually. UFO. These guys are speedy. But not that difficult to fight. Thirty-eight. You got interrupted, so we got to do this again. Warriors. Enter now. Search for the Hawkeye. Alright. Really? Shattered man, huh? After this, I'm gonna cut it. See you guys next time. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.